Hello, I'm Erwin Timmers. I'm co-founder of the Washington Glass School. I want to show you around the studio. Come on in. We're in Mount Rainier, Gateway Arts District. And uh, I just completed the project for Artisan 4100 building, which is also Mount Rainier. And I wanted to show you some of the process that we I went through to get there. Um, so you've probably seen there are five lit panels. Um, they uh, represent five different materials that could be or should be recycled. It's a little bit of a play on the five traditional media of craft. And in order to get those panels, I use recycled materials, use recycled glass. This is some of my supply that you see. And I have to go through quite a process to get from the individual shards to the final cast panels. In all the panels, you'll see that there's a pattern where the images of the discarded objects slowly fall down Tetris style and end up being a recycled product at the very bottom of the panels. Um, there's various stages to get through. First, I have to cast flat pieces of glass, and then later I get the shape into them with another casting. Let me show you some of my other work. Um, it's all about recycling, the environment, the uh, roles that um, people play in that, how we discard resources as a society. Um, so this is a, um, one of my favorite series of pieces um, where I basically take all sorts of single-use items, packaging, um, plastics, um, whatever I can find, and cast them in glass, glass cast their shapes in glass, and end up um, using those shapes in, in patterns that really intrigue me. Um, perhaps you can recognize some of the pieces that I've used. Um, I've got another piece over here, a little bit bigger, uh, a little bit more conceptual. It talks basically about cities and the environment. The piece is called Step Back for a Better View. And uh, it examines our role of how architecture shapes the way we live, um, whether there are alternatives, what the consequences are. Um, and again, you can see the recycled glass in the middle here. Um, that's the, the tempered window glass that shatters into a million pieces. Um, also using LEDs, very low energy form of light, um, making it all a very sustainable type of art. Um, this is a piece from another series that I did. This is a, my take on fake news from 100 years ago. This was when Percival Lowell convinced the writers from the New York Times that there was indeed life on Mars. He built an observatory in Arizona and he saw canals and signs of life and so was um, instrumental in getting the Times to write this article. There can be no doubt there's life on Mars. Um, these are some of my other pieces from various series. You can see that the water bottles are sort of a pet peeve of mine, very recurring theme. Um, this was um, part of a series of rubber band balls that um, I made hundreds of um, and the postman kept on bringing me more, so it was a good inspiration. And then over here, you can see there's another series of single-use wrapping materials. Um, I keep finding more and more designs that I want to use. And um, this is a series in blue. I've got a series in green coming up as well. It's fun to come up with different patterns. And then the last one over here, I want to show you what I'm working on currently. It's a series using hands. Um, it started with um, a bunch of pieces I made with my daughter and her hands and um, now I'm uh, creating more different versions. Um, I love the, the love hands. Um, introducing some color, recycled glass, and um, hopefully these will be all finished soon and if you want to find out more, website is erwintimmers.com.